You're not even trying to understand what this means to us, are you? What is there to understand about a bunch of guys who have to prove themselves by beating each other's brains out? Why did you become a reporter? What does that have to do with it? Just answer the question. My father was a reporter. I was a good writer. It seemed like the right thing for me to do. And you want to be the best reporter you can be for him and yourself, right? Yes, that's right. Well, I'm just trying to be the best I can be. Not just for me. Teach me. You taught me using any technique that works. Never to limit myself to one style. To keep an open mind. What? To honor you.
Post-workout thoughts. This um, workout was dedicated to my late cousin, Ryan Miller. So, and anybody that has had a loss knows the emptiness you feel inside when you have a loved one pass away and move on. I wasn't all together into it for this workout because of that and because we had like this northeastern yesterday that just dumped a whole bunch of snow on us. We got more than we were supposed to get and everything iced up and there was a whole bunch of jackknife tractor trailers and my, my dad got stuck at work and, and I told my wife not to go to work and she went to work so I had to go rescue her and it was like one solid sheet of ice to get home so I had that. And then I left my music, my headphones, which gets me even more hyped up for my workout at home today. So it was just like one thing after another. You know, you're going to have days like that. The, the, the push isn't there. But you go in, you say, darn it, I'm going in anyway. And I'm going to do my best. I'm going to give it my best. Even if your whole world's coming down on you. So we worked up to the barbell press. I got to 140 for five. Not bad, not too shabby. I had a PR today, the most I've ever done post-injury for shoulder press, barbell shoulder press, and that was one plus two push presses at 155 pounds. So I'm very happy with that. And of course you saw me do the pointing at the sky for my cousin, miss you bro. So then we moved on to dumbbell shoulder press and we, I worked all the way up. Uh, my best of five was 50 pounds. And then I did, I only could do one for 70. Um, maybe this will be my comeback for next shoulder day because I was kind of kind of upset about that. I wish I would have done more with 70 pounds, but I only did one. Kind of my shoulders were starting to burn and really hurting, so I let off and I, I just did one for 70 pounds, which I, I'm, I'm happy with that because that's more than I've ever done post-injury. Hey, you're making progress, you're making gains. Hey, I'll take it. Then we moved on to a little bit of, I didn't show everything. I didn't show all of my front and lat raises, but you saw me getting into them. And then to finish it off, we went to Smith Presses, where I worked my way up to 160 pounds, and I was totally burned out by then, and I got two of those. And then I did a burnout set, which I thought would go better, at 115, and of course it didn't, because I'm just totally toasted at this point, so I only got nine reps of that. We'll leave that there. So, until next time, dream big, keep fighting, and get some!